The following podcast is rated M for Mature. What is up, you guys? Welcome to another episode of the Rating Pending Podcast. I am your host, Victor the Red, and here we are with the original two from the first first podcast. And hey, guys, it's been a month. Happy month anniversary. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> anyway, here with me, Pedro, also known as Vote for Pedro 74. Well, yeah, you got it right. Woo! Fuck yeah. <laughs> And, you know, the asshole, uh, Carlos, also known as Mother <laughs> Mega. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, guys, uh, for this ep- uh, for this episode, we got you th- these three topics. We got yourself the home from the revolution from Crytek to Dip Silver now. The Last of Us One Night Live, our uh, thoughts and reaction. And last but not least, Pedro, take it away. No Man's Sky is no longer a PS4 exclusive. It's still not coming for for Xbox, so, so I'm happy with that. Uh, is it? No, no it's, it's not. It's, it's only uh, it's well, only so coming far, for I don't, PC. I don't, I don't it's only for it. PC. I, I, and I, don't, PS4. I don't see anything that says Microsoft in it. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, fuck so, Xbox. <laughs> So let's start with the <laughs> let's start with that. Let's start with No Man's Sky. Um, uh, excellent reveal this year that E3, oh, obviously. Oh, great! Indie game. Well, like well, I, re- I think not this reveal, be not the... reveal. You know, they showed more stuff. Mm-hmm. For this. Uh, excellent game that is coming out. It's one of the indie games mo- uh, most. I think it's the most awaited uh, yeah. indie game. If you may. Uh, Pedro, can you talk about the, the No Man's Sky if you have the article there? Okay. Um, yes. Um, no Man's Sky is per- personally for me one of the most anticipated games for the PS4 because I don't think I've ever seen such a game that has such an ambition imbi- behind it. You know, um, have, like basically you get to do what you always wanted to do since since you were a little kid. You get to explore the world. You get to visit different landscapes, different um, caves, different creatures, different different um, environments. And in in that, like, it's not going to be a PS4 exclusive anymore. No, it's not a big deal, you know. For obviously me, it's I not think... a big deal. Obviously not. It just I know the game is going to sell like yeah. cakes. That... That's one of the indie, one but of the indie still, games I'm most looking forward to. But but we're not saying that PS4 still has exclusive. That's going to be free for the PlayStation. No, no, it's going to be time um, PS4 exclusive. So PS4 will have it yeah. for a for a short while, and then it will no, go gonna on free, to though. PC. No, it's going to be free though. It's going to be a free to play, and PC they're going to need to pay for it. Yeah. Uh, really? Uh, yeah. So, so still, so, PS4 but, winning. But, so. Basically, on PS4, you gotta get it for free or something. What? Well, if you're PlayStation Plus, like uh, of obviously, course, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I, like I don't like what they're doing with the PlayStation. Like, oh, if you have PlayStation Plus, you get this for free. Of course, we have PlayStation Plus. Exactly. Like, if you want to play with your PS4, you need PlayStation Plus. Ex- obviously, yeah. It's that's one of the main reasons why the PS4. You have to have the PlayStation Plus subscription. Not unlike the PS3, which is free, but the Plus is, uh, you know, it's optional. But still, it's, it's a good value. Gold, it's a, it's it's one of the best values. You get free games, obviously. Yep. No, PS4, PS Plus is enough. Like PS Plus is probably one of the big best um, values you can get because, like, I own a PS4 and a PS3, and I get two free games for each console every month and it's my favorite really... subscription that the, the of all gaming subscriptions it's the they give you a free game that can cost 50 bucks retail and you just give it for free yeah and okay, you only... and how much is the PS, uh, playstation plus for a year uh 50 dollars a $50. year uh five dollars i think a for month. every month a game that can cost 40 plus dollars that's worth it for me. Yeah. It is. And it is. It is. Um, it's, it is actually a very good value with the PS um, plus subscription. You know, the plus. It's really. It's a really good deal. This month we have, what, Crisis 3, I think? We have Crisis 3? 
Uh, for PS3, I think so. Uh, let, let me check the. Yeah, yeah, Crisis 3 is coming. Oh yeah, month. yeah, yeah, the, yeah. It's uh, and this Fez, month. Fez is going PS Vita. Yeah, and PS4, I think too. Ah, yeah, PS4. Oh, oh PS4? Yes. Dude, that game is amazing. <laughs> Wait, you have PS4? Yeah, I do have PS4. Oh. And um. So. What are you looking forward most in No Man's Sky? Uh, multiplayer. Um, what well, what they're saying, what they're selling, is a massive multiplayer. Oh, a uh, uh, a massive open world multiplayer. It looks the only thing. The only thing that I I don't get me wrong. It's not that I don't like the game at all. I haven't played it, and it looks amazing. The only thing that bothers me that I told uh, Sebastian, one of our friends, and even I told you, Carlos, um, that it's the it's the color, the color in one planet. Maybe it's the planet, just the it's, planet. It's, it's the planet. It's the planet. Yeah, you already the explained yeah, that. If, if, oh, okay. no, you weren't the only one that had problems with that. Yeah, they explained cause, that cause, to the... Because if developer. it was like that, I was like, wow, the colors really, really look... Uh, no, not, each, not dull, that, but it, it, thing, it, it, it's eye-numbing. Like. Yeah, another thing I like about that game is when you spawn, that's your planet. Nobody else has spawned in that planet. Yeah. The, it's literally a universe. Like... It's space. It's infinite. Wow. Even the developer said we're not. We haven't found find stuff that you're gonna find. Wow. That's actually really, really. You know, that's really good. And you can find other person's planet. And basically. Um, explore. Explore. I'm not sure if there's gonna be a PVP in ground. Well, there is. Uh, like, I, I think there's weapons. I hope there's weapons. I, th I think there's weapons. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I think I, you think it, there's weapons. Yeah, but they haven't shown anything. Weapons. They're, they're not gonna show nothing at, no. at all at the moment. And they, they shouldn't. They shouldn't. Yeah, they should keep it uh, incognito, uh, secret. Like it's it's better that way because it keeps up with the hype. You see, this is one of the things that I would do with the Last Guardian. Uh, going back to that bandwagon. Um, that's huh, here one, we go. Uh, that's one thing that I I would do with the Last Guardian. You see the No Man's Sky? It gives you some peak. Yeah, it's coming, it's coming, but we don't have anything to say about it. We, uh, but here's a here's a, a small footage. Give us that to fucking Last Guardian, man. That's it's really stupid that they just keeping in the closet. Is like no, no, we're not we're not gonna reveal shit. We're not gonna reveal bullshit. We're just gonna keep it there. And, uh, no, no, no. Yeah, no. It's been canceled. No, no, no. It's still going. That's. Uh, that, I'm still. I'm still butt hurt with that. I'm really. I'm really pissed with the Last Guardian uh, stuff. But I don't want. I, I, I can I, sense Victor turning red. Yeah, I'm already red, man. That's 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 the life of a game. In that's, this time, like they're yeah, gonna get canceled. It, it, the, but go. dude, it's the last garden. It's been what in, in high end for how how much? How many years? Five years and no nothing to say. Like oh no, and what is the last thing they told us? Oh no, uh, the, the the developer is working on it whenever he the fucking. I don't like that. That's fucking stupid. I, I'm gonna work with the game whenever the fuck I want. Okay, that, so it, do you even want that game now? I if they're not I, good, I, 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 for if they're me, not even right good, now, try to do right, the game. Right Why do you want the game? Right now, because it's not, it's not just me. The people wants it. Okay, but do you want a a unfinished shitty ass game? Because that's what you're gonna get. I don't if, trust game develop uh, game develop you know develop games from five years and more. I don't want to go to that bandwagon of Alien Colonial Marines. I don't want to go to that shit. Because you, you, you've seen that, Carlos. Let it go, you... man. Okay, just let it go. Let it's it gonna... go. Let it, let it go. <laughs> <laughs> Copyright, though. <laughs> Don't give a shit anymore. Uh, what? All right. But, no. Game of Constance, guys. Yeah. <laughs> but it's, you know, it. how do I want that game. I really want that game to at least give us something. At least a five-second clip. I, I'm really good with a five-second clip or a ten-second clip saying it's coming. But... Chill, your tits, it's coming. I just want that shit, but I don't want to go. Th you know, it's not this topic, so I'm just gonna move it. I'm just gonna yeah. let it go. Let, let it go. go. 
Chimera. But no. Uh, so let's go with The Last of Us. Oh, God. The Last of Us One Night Live. Amazing performance. Yes. Amazing. Yeah. Pedro, have you seen it or you didn't see it? Um, I saw like the, uh, like the first half an hour and I stopped watching it because I haven't finished The Last of Us yet. So they won't spoil oh, my yeah, yeah. myself. Some what stuff. But like, saw. <laughs> okay, Wait, I was got, waiting. You got it for PS4 and the, re the remastered? Oh uh, yeah, I was waiting for to get the PS4. I haven't gotten it yet because I don't have the money yet. But hopefully, but by you next got week, the I'll last of us. I haven't gotten it yet. Oh, you! Oh, so you don't have the game? <laughs> I, I will buy it. It's just like I don't have the money right now. So you haven't played it. So you have. You've never played it. I played it. For a little bit. You, okay, you know the beginning. You know that. No, no spoilers, yes. please. No spoilers. But you know the yes. beginning. What happens in the beginning? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, then okay. You, you didn't miss that much. Uh, but going back with uh with the Last of Us One Night Live. Uh, it w it it was this past Monday, yeah. on uh it was on Twitch, PlayStation Network, and YouTube. on YouTube. Yeah. And uh, obviously. It's still on PlayStation Network if you want to see it. I no, I already downloaded it on my PC. No, I'm I talking to the viewers. I'm oh sure yeah. About yeah. Oh, okay. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I still have it. I still have it here. I watched it two times already, and I'm. I. That's I'm, that gives me good hope for the movie. Yeah, like if, indeed, and it's Neil Druckmann who's freaking directing yeah, it, or I, I know he's the writer, fucking but video I don't know game about movie this. should do like the same person that did the fucking video game does the fucking movie. Exactly. Isn't he writing it? He's think, writing it. He's I, writing I don't know about directing. I don't no, know about is, that. He's directing it too. You are you sure? No. Yeah, I don't, he is. No, I checked that it, there wasn't nothing about directing. Uh, what I heard is um Sam Raimi is producing. Uh, oh, Neil Sam Raimi is directing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sam Raimi is directing it. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no I remember. I remembered. I remember. No, you said producing. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, he's directing, in which I have no problem. I really have no problem with Sam Raimi. But uh. The one thing, the one thing that it did, it, it doesn't bother me, but it's still, uh, you know, I'm still scratching my head. It's Bruce Campbell isn't there. I love Bruce Campbell, but is he gonna be Joel? I don't think so. I don't, I don't look at him as Joel. I, I, I like, I like him, but just, I don't, I don't see him as a serious actor. Uh, like, exa exactly. I just feel like. Like he's more like the you know like the comedic relief guy. Like I can see him being um, um another character in the Last of Us universe. Like, yeah, uh, exactly. Like, it could be. Uh, you haven't played Last of Us, that's the thing. No, we can't. Uh, say like I, can't I, I know say the character that much, but yeah, I, I know the let's, talk, let's talk. Let's talk. Uh, you know the main characters. We got Joel, Ellie. Uh, you got Ellie. Joel and Ellie. Um, Tess. other uh, other character Tess. We got uh, Marlene. We Tess. Got, uh, we got Marlene. Marlene. Uh, what, what was the guy? Um, I, 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 it's like, I, like, I remember, like, he was, like, crazy. Oh, yeah. Billy. Billy, Billy yeah. Could, it, uh, you know, B Billy wouldn't be a bad option for for Bruce Campbell. But, or, no, Billy was a little if, crazy. If it, yeah, he's crazy. He's but, not funny. He's just crazy. Uh, crazy, yeah. But, like, I think Bruce Campbell can pull it off, you know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Bruce Campbell can pull it off. But going back to the One Night Live, amazing performance. One of the best thing, one of the best project experience I've ever seen. Because that was just a project, actually. Mm -hmm. yeah, to see and they how even it rehearsed. Goes. And like it, they just, it, no, they rehearsed the night like, before. Exactly. And uh, and they pulled it off. You can see uh, Neil Druckmann right there in the when they performed that stuff in. They nailed it. You see Neil Druckmann. Oh, they did it. Fuck yeah. That's another moment. <laughs> and that's actually, that was, uh, that was amazing. That was um, and, well, there was one blooper that they what? couldn't, the, the one where uh, she couldn't find the gun. Ah, uh, yeah, that was a one blooper. Yeah. But still, it was, uh, if, you, if you look at it this way, it was perfect. Yeah, was, for what was... they were, for the timing that they did, it was. And the thing is, and the thing perfect. is, yeah. uh, I don't want to spoil the alternate ending. I want people to see that. Oh, the alternate ending is the best thing I've ever seen. And it was actually a prank. The fun fact, it was actually a prank to Troy Baker, which is the voice yep. actor of Joel. And it, it's something really, really funny in the, in the video game. And 
in the... The extras in the video game. Um, yeah, it's in the extras in the video game. But, yeah. uh, like, it's one thing that it was... You know, it was just a prank, actually. Yeah, it was, yeah. A, it was a prank to Troy Baker. Um, I'm actually a big fan of Troy Baker's... Uh, I a, a Troy Baker, uh, you know, his work, actually. It's it's really amazing what he do. And Ashley Johnson is not... Like, he's not far from that. And Ashley Johnson can do... She can do the best thing ever later on. Like, if she lands any role in any movie, she can freaking, uh, you know, perfect yeah. it. And the girl who does Taz, but still, the one nightlife uh, performance thing, everything was amazing. If you haven't played The Last of Us, what it, what what the fuck are you waiting for? You don't have a PS3, it's okay, but you should get a PS4 and play it on remastered. <laughs> it, it, yeah, it, it's, it's, it, it's it, it's not because it's 1080p, 60 frame per second. Uh, uh, it, Pull that out. Like, it doesn't matter. The good thing is you're gonna really, really enjoy the game at max. It's one of the best. Yeah. It's one of the best artistic masterpiece in a video game I've ever seen in my life. And, and the people that have it in PS3, you can turn it in. You yeah. Can get people, it. people who has it on PS3, uh, you can yeah. turn that in on um. Uh, but at least right now. I don't know later on. I know they're gonna take that down later on. But if you have the opportunity oh. to listen this now uh you can take your last of us ps3 version trade it in and you get a discount i think it's a 50 percent discount yeah yeah uh, it's it's gonna cost you like uh 25 25 they give you they give you what 25 in trade-in uh um, yeah credit yeah. and yeah the game is not full retail 60 and it's it, it gives you all the 50. dlcs so it's worth it exactly if uh if you haven't played left behind or you haven't down uh, downloaded any dlc whatsoever you have a, like just the original version nothing else and you have a ps4 you can take that trade it in gamestop i'm yeah. not i'm not giving free fucking advertising to gamestop but it's a good thing that you would trade it for they your ps4 us. version but it's uh you should do that it's uh, the 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 graphics Everything I saw a video uh, not so long ago, the comparison, and and there's man, a and, and there's man. a difference. I have it in PS4, and there's uh, a huge uh, difference. There's a huge difference. People actually don't like the 60 frame stuff, but in this in this occasion, you're you're really gonna love it. Uh, it's yeah. it's actually really good. But going back to the One Night Live, uh, it it was this was just an experience, um, like a like a project. Actually, they just wanted to test. I that I want to know I want to know who created that. It, if it was Jeff Keighley, this one of the if it was no, Jeff, Jeff Keighley, Keighley was the one that forced it on them. Like, hey, you should try this out. May it but work, still, may but still, it. you know, we know Jeff Keighley has done horrible stuff at VG uh, the VGA. So no, that's not his fault. He was the one. No, 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 no. no. That wasn't he directs and he do the stuff on VGX or VGAs, whatever you want to call, because the last these last three freaking years or four has been horrible. Last year was the ho most horrible video game awards I've seen. But it wasn't his fault. It was the other fucking host. Well, if it was, I, if it, it, no. it, 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 it was, no, it was No, 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 no. Joel McHale was actually trolling Jeff Keighley. Cause it the show was getting boring already, and he was like, "Oh my god, fuck this!" And you know, he's just trolling Jeff Keighley. I know it. if you could see the VGX, cause it's VGX. Cause I don't know VGA. I didn't see or it. Wait, I saw it. Sadly, I saw it. But um, I'm I don't gonna... know why did they why did they do that? Why was that? No, no, this is edition? that's not the thing. I'm I'm guessing it was so bad that even Spike TV said no, we're not gonna take this. You do it. Uh, you oh, do that it was di live. Digital. Fuck Wait, was that, that was that live or? No, it was digital no. only. It was on the on the website. It it was on online. It wasn't on uh, Spike TV. Spike. No, TV I know it wasn't on Spike, it. but was it live? Was yeah, it, it was live. It yeah, was it was live. live. Not recorded. It was live. Um, so how would they know if it's good or bad? Cause it, dude, yeah. it, it, the last three years has been horrible, man. The last four years, Jeff it wasn't Keighley, that bad. This no, was it, was, it, it all started in the 2000, I think 11, when uh, uh, not you know not not bashing on people. I don't want to get into, uh, I don't want people hating, but this is my opinion. It all started 
it all started on 2011 on the VGAs. Uh, I think one of the one of the few good VGAs because you know Samuel L. Jackson was in it and it was yeah. good. Uh, I think it, no, that's 2012. But in the 2011 one, I was in Orlando. I remember this. I was waiting to see if Batman Arkham City was uh, was gonna win because damn it, that was a good fucking storyline. And it on story wise, I'm I'm more of a storyteller guy. Gameplay, yeah. Um, that was the year that Skyrim won. You know, for I played, story. I, I, no, for everything. Game of the year for everything. In which, in one. Of, in, all right, let's put it this. Let's put. Let's compare this. I know I'm going way off topic, but let's just put this. You got Batman Arkham City. No spoilers. I'm still not giving spoilers for that game. Um, you got Batman Arkham City, in which it's op uh, If you can say it's open world. It's open world. It's it's yeah. a sand. Yeah. Is is it, yeah. It's an open world. Yes, there is invisible walls, but um, it's open world. Uh, you can fly around. If something happens in the city, there is a crime going on. You can go to that crime, beat the sh living shit out of the other guy, and um, just carry on with the story. It's, it's a it's good a, game. It's a perfect. It's game. it's it's a, it's, a, it's an amazing game. Let's go with this Elder Scrolls Five Skyrim. Skyrim is amazing in any way. Uh, it's there's endless possibilities you can do in that game. There's it's it's a massive world. There's cave to explore, quest to do. In story wise, I didn't like it that much. It, 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 it because not because I didn't like the story. I like the idea of oh, I'm gonna start the story. Oh. Here's a random event. Oh, I forgot the story. Let me just go to this place. Ooh, what is this? You get curious by anything. I like that. But going to story-wise, it wasn't that very good compared to Arkham City. I think Arkham City had the most solid story I've seen in the DC universe, in video games, actually. I don't have seen any because you got Batman Dark Tomorrow in which it was, it was horrible. That game was, it was freaking horrible. You got a uh, what? Uh, Batman Vengeance. Batman Vengeance was amazing, and it was based on the uh, Batman the animated series. Yep. Uh, but going on with this, or uh, with the Arkham City on 2011, they gave uh, the game the game of the year to Skyrim, in which I wasn't that happy with it, cause. Okay, but Skyrim is a still a good game. Yeah, it's it, a good game. It deserves Un the... unlike the massive bugs that it has, but the uh, but the but the game is actually it really earned good. it. It I... earned it. It earned it. Yeah, there are other good games, but it earned it. So I'm yeah, not. But you know, you know what? What was the fishy stuff about that man? It, it was the 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 the. It was getting. It, it was not just hyped. It was just that VGA was sponsored by. Uh, like they were sponsoring a lot of fucking Skyrim. Like they were hyping that game up the ass, like so badly. Like they were basically, I don't know. It's just oh, if you pay, I just feel like if they said oh, if I pay you, you think it'll give me game of the year, or if you pay me, I'll make sure you win game of it's the year. That, that's why I stopped watching award videos. Yeah, exactly. Anything I, award, know, I know. Like because it's all pay. They already know who's gonna win. It's all a fucking show. You don't matter. You're not important. You don't decide who wins. Exactly. I I voted on Batman. Obviously, I voted, but I I I, 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 I obviously th I obviously obviously think. Oh, sorry. Thought that uh that that thing was rigged. Obviously, everything is rigged. fucking rigged. Everything is yeah, rigged. of course, everything is rigged. Everything is fucking rigged. Cause I I've never seen a video game award saying, oh, this game fucking deserved it. Uh, I for that time for that time again for that time, I didn't think uh, Elder Scrolls Five well, was uh, you know it, it didn't matter for me. Like I played it, and I didn't like it at the beginning. Then I played it again. Then I got the you know I got the feeling of it. I really liked it, but not for me a game of the year. For me, for me again, for me people who you know uh, people like it's Elder Scrolls it's Five. It's Opinions. Don't worry, don't worry. If you like it, good. Uh, for me, I didn't yeah, like it that speech. much. Yeah. But, uh... I don't know. It's just, it wasn't. But, and uh, finishing the One Night Live topic. 
<laughs> I like just, how we just uh, derailed everything. Yeah, we, I really rail <laughs> fucked. We fucked up big time. Though. Oh, we but, have time. But we got time. We got time. Um, again, play The Last of Us if you haven't. Trade in your PS3 version if you have PS4, though. If you have your PS3 trade your version, Xbox. trade it. Uh, <laughs> but trade in your uh, PS3 version of The Last of Us and get the PS4 because it's actually really amazing. Yeah. And if you and if you say, oh no, I just finished it, I really don't need, it. dude, no, no, don't be like that. Like DLC get style. it, get it. For, yeah, for the DLC side, you get all the DLC that came out, the multiplayer and the Left Behind. In which Left Behind, they told me that it was amazing too. It was yeah. another masterpiece. So why the hell not? get it you'll really like it and when you finish that game make sure you watch the one night live and uh, you're really going to enjoy it. it it lasts only one hour if I'm not mistaken you get you get the performances of uh, Troy Baker Ashley Johnson uh, you know, the composer that wrote this music Gustav for Gustav the Gustavo game Santo Elijah. Oh. you get you know yeah he, he's great, great. You, when you see that and when you hear uh, the theme of The Last of Us and the ending theme of The Last of Us. It's, oh my God, it's, it's, it's amazing. It's beautiful. It, it's, ma it's amazing and beautiful how you, how you listen to it and looked at it live. It's really amazing. And, uh, at the end of The Last of Us One Night Live, when they get off stream, you know, there was no stream at all. It was just for the people who was there. Um, uh, they got a special acted scene that was um i'm not gonna spoil because that, that that's a huge yeah, just... spoiler that's a mega spoiler Barely. but they acted out what was going to be the ultra the, ending. you could say the marvel ending you could say that like the oh, just say alternate uh, ending the, the, the alternate ending. ending no but let's put it that way let's put it uh for people more to or alternate ending or the however you want to understand it but uh, it, it's it's it, it happens a long time like it happens after the events of uh, going on from Last of Us. But still, big spoiler when you see that. Uh, I w I'll touch this topic when I don't. I think a year later, maybe. <laughs> I'll, I'll I'll yeah. I'll talk about this more later. Like later on, I'll I'll get back into this. But still enjoy the game and uh and when you finish it go back to one night live now let's go to the cream of the crop home front crytech deep silver god damn it <laughs> yep uh, you were doing so good uh, and then done uh, fucked up i'm gonna quote angry joe here sorry angry joe uh you don't fuck it up <laughs> <laughs> you don't fuck you don't fuck that up. Like you were doing so good, and then you just said, "Oh, but, but, uh, I heard so they're good at doing video games." You reveal the home front, the revolution, and then eh, Deep Silver has it. Uh, are they, what? What exactly is Deep Silver? Uh, do you have the article there? Um, uh, uh, I I do. Um, what it, does, it says what exactly it says out. there? What exactly? Um, Deep, says? Silver Deep Silver gets all um, the fucking games and then destroy them. Okay, um, right, the so no article. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What are you saying? Deep Silver has announced it's acquired all rights to the Homefront franchise from Crytek and will now be in charge in development of the upcoming title Homefront: The Revolution. Will be. Yeah, the publisher is best known for Dead Island and Saints Row. Oh. Oh, okay, <laughs> it has confirmed okay. it's opening a new studio in Nottingham, England, to continue the project and will be also be. So, so well, it's not getting rebooted. All coherent assets. So it's not getting nope. rebooted. They're just gonna keep working with the whatever they have. They better. No one. That's what I, I'm understanding here. Uh, it's just I don't see it because if they were working on it on uh, <sighs> on Crytek, uh, what uh, it, uh, are you gonna? Uh, 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 is the writer gonna go to England to work on this shit? Oh, wh where exactly is it, um, Pedro? What? Nottingham, England. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was right. On England, is he gonna move to England too, so he can work on this <laughs> fucking project, or is this the, does he still work for Crytek? For Christ, I don't know. I don't know. I think they're gonna get like a, a whole new group. Like they, they'll work with whatever they have. What I'm afraid that they're gonna do I, is I, just 
gonna do I, the same I, thing that they did with the Colonial Marines. They, they're they're just gonna strip <laughs> everything out and make their own game. Yeah, I, I have that. I have that that feeling too. Please right? don't do that. But like, uh, my it's... question is, is like, since like they have been like this franchise has been moved from different developers for the past few years. Two like, years, actually, three studios in two years. That's fucked up. Oh. Like, like, why does this franchise have that many people want it? You know. Well, what is it? THQ no. when it closed, Crytek, and now fucking. Deep Silver? What the fuck? Silver's gonna destroy the video game franchise! <laughs> oh, have, yeah. you, have, have you ever played fucking Right Hell Revolution? I have! <laughs> it's right not a fun game! <laughs> no! No, it's fucking... Nobody's left. I'm, I'm sorry, I just remember an Angry Joe Angry Review, dude. It, it was actually funny. But, um... Man. And they were thinking about doing fucking sequels! It, no, there was actually it was gonna be a trilogy, to be exact. Shut it was the gonna, fuck but, up, <laughs> <laughs> dude. But but Deep Silver said that well, a lot of people will, oh, it, it will love it, and a lot of people will laugh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was horrible. But yeah, it's now, so, all people not, take drugs. No, no, <laughs> Nottingham, England is gonna on Nottingham. What in England is they gonna work on it, right? Yes. Oh man, I I just imagine there would be like, hey guys, no offense, I'm just I'm just doing an impression here, no offense. Oh, God. Uh, I'm just I'm just I'm just imagining it like. Just don't, what? just don't, don't. What the bollocks is this? Oh, <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but I just had to. I'm just imagining them like when they look at it, it's like, all right, what the fuck are we working on here? I don't know. I. Just, I I they're think they're gonna, uh, yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna strip down everything. Just gonna start from zero. Oh, I think I think that's the best option, to be honest. Shut up. <laughs> no, or like if... I prefer, I prefer if then they just like okay, cut like this, get rid of everything and just start from scrap. Because no. I, I don't like when they work with things they they don't have control over or they don't have the, the that that in mind. Exactly. I don't so just start from scratch, you know, make a new game, and hopefully it'll all be as good or even better than the original project. Yeah. Also, it, it, it would be it would be a better idea if they did that. Uh, but still, but still, cry, uh, Deep Silver. Uh, oh my god. Yeah, I, they don't have a I, very good repertoire. Yeah, I have so many mixed feelings with Deep Silver. I don't like them. I don't like them. People you that like the, Deep Silver don't kill yourself. <laughs> like, you... literally. What does Deep Silver have that other game companies don't have? Like, Deep Silver... Money. You know, their, you know, you know what? Their, their line of video games are all shit. Like, the <laughs> only good game that they did, and I don't even like it, is fucking Saints Row. Yeah. It's a, it's a fun game. It's a fun game, yeah. I, I kind of like it. Still prefer GTA... In other games. Hey, dude. But it's Saints still, Row, it's Saints Row. It's basically a parody. It's they just, don't know how to do video games, games correctly. Again, right to hell, fucking retribution. What like else? if you what do else? that, if you yeah. do a game like that, you sh the, the, shouldn't do video it, games. It, 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 <laughs> I'm looking yeah, at the, at the list of games right now. You know what? You know what? I'm pissed that too. I'm gonna join you, Carlo. And I think this is one of the most no. surprised thing you're ever gonna hear. But I'm gonna join you in that. You know why? Cause fuck, you see, amazing games getting canceled, exactly. but this shit, but this shit goes on. Like it, it just yep. pushes out the door. I'm, I'm, you know what? I'm pissed now. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking pissed. Yep. I'm fucking pissed. Fuck you, Dip Silver. <laughs> Damn. Destroying all our good games. Man, a freaking Deep Silver well, is like... Well, um, like... they do have Metro Last Light, and that was a really good game. Uh, well, that's... Shut the fuck up, Pedro! <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be the devil's advocate, okay? It's trying to find positive... Okay, yeah, I'm... Metro Last Light, that was like the... That was, only a, that was a good game. I liked great it. game that they did? Um, I'm I looking. I liked it. It was but, fun. But, I liked but, it. but, but... But... Right. There we go. You still, Deep this. Silver. Fuck you. Oh... I, I didn't know they'd make this game. Um, Catherine. I play. I played Catherine. It was. Um, they they it was right. published it. It was alright. It was alright. Well, it was okay. It was it was alright. Nothing that I would play all the time, but it was alright. 
Okay, so what happened to them? Why are they doing this shit? Yeah, they had to push that out the door. Are they like different to uh, Deep Silver companies or something that we all know of? You know what would be the most surprising thing if Deep Silver actually buys Capcom? Oh! Hey. I think I, I don't think it can, but hey, it's a possibility. Anything is possible in this world. Uh, well, Disney, Disney is gonna buy Capcom. <laughs> Oh, no. It'll be smart for them to do no, it. It'll be horrible, man. This, this, <laughs> Why this, are you saying these? It will be horrible, man. I, I don't want to even imagine Evil. freaking Resident Evil made by Disney. <laughs> yeah, we'll have I'm Mickey in the background be like, Haha, you can <laughs> kill all those zombies, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right. Uh, th putting an end here. You, know, you guys know that... Oh god, uh, Carlos, you're gonna you're gonna hurl, you're gonna hurl, man. So I'm sorry, but I have to say it. You guys know that the Dead Island movie is still go on production. It's gonna be. Wait, that's a thing. Yeah, it's a thing. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm, I'm, I'm surprised it's even a thing. People are like, Why for me, uh, for me, thing? I. Oh, this is it's this not is even this a good game. This is the God, thing that I'm gonna God. say. This is the thing I'm gonna say. Why make a Dead Island movie if it doesn't have an important story? It doesn't it have a. It doesn't. A movie it's, if it's, it's not a good game. It's uh, no. Let's put the game aside. Let's talk about the story because they're gonna make it a movie. What the fuck are you gonna? What the fuck are you gonna show us? For it's Dead Island be, movie from fucking, the game. What? What? You gonna put a cinema in it? What? Movie. What are you gonna do? What exactly are uh, you gonna do? I think they could just like like grab the concept of Dead Island and make a movie out of it because everyone yeah, you think about it, the concept of Dead Island. If you look at it, what is the concept? They're just zombies. They just came out of nowhere. This is a survival movie, basically movie. Exactly. Oh my god, I don't know. It, it's a, it's another zombie movie. That's that's not gonna be Dead Island. It's another zombie movie. If you actually put the fucking um, enemies from Dead Island, well then. I see it like a Dawn of the Dead movie. Exactly. Yeah. And uh, I see Dawn of the Dead. I saw it when I saw Dawn of the Dead. I liked it. I, I don't give a shit what people say. I really. It was a, it's a good movie. It, it was good a movie. But when I saw Dawn of the Dead and I played Dead Rising one, it's like, oh yeah, I remind, this reminds me of Dawn of the Dead. Exactly. You got your. Uh, well, they did get expert. Yeah, just... they got you know yeah. the story from Dead Rising. But you know what? They, that can make the Dead Island movie like like actually good if they make it a comedy. Cause like, what, I don't, right, like you're gonna like, make another Shaun of the Dead. They'll make a fucking movie. You're gonna make another like, Shaun of the Dead. Okay, Shaun of the Dead was great. It, it, exactly. But no, like, no, no, no. Shaun of the Dead was good. It was funny, but it was awesome. It it was fucking amazing. But still, if you're gonna say a comedy, what, what, uh, for Shaun of the Dead, maybe what? Like, it's, like you know, like how the Dead Island Two trailer is like, like that guy like walking around like California and like he has his music on his ears and like the zombies. The gameplay. That's just visuals. Yeah, like they could make a movie like that. I'll I'll watch it. But it, w the thing is, uh, Pedro, what does that provide from the Dead Island game, from the Dead Island universe? There is no fucking universe. It's actually oh just, nothing, uh, it's, nothing it's, at it's all. It's just it's just zombies that came out of the fucking nowhere. Yeah. Well, I think I think the exception would be for Dead Island quotation Dead Island. If there's act they're in an actual island and there's fucking zombies. But still, yeah, we're, go we're, still, we're still, we're still, we're still going, we're still there going on the Dawn of the Dead, on the Dawn of the Dead bandwagon at the ending when they just found out an island, and there were zombies in it. Yeah. It's spoilers. I don't give a shit. It's a movie. It's a fucking old movie. It's old. Yeah, it's an old movie. But another thing. Another thing. Uh, get a little out of co uh topic. What's with the fucking trailer of Dead Island Two? Like, is it gonna be in the United States? Looks I like it. So. It looks like in California. It is. How is it gonna be called fucking Dead Island? They're not in a fucking island. It's a big island, Carlos. <laughs> <laughs> fuck up, Victor. I know where you live. <laughs> no, but it, yeah, exactly. Maybe, maybe they were. Oh no. Sense. Uh, but you imagine. But well, it, it is. It is. I'm assuming that's fucking Cali, or it, they it, or they just gonna say, "Oh no, we're in Hawaii." I'm gonna hunt Deep Silver down and kill them. If they say. <laughs> It's fucking California. It's the fucking uh... California. What's the name of that fucking strip? Uh, uh, Venice Beach. Yeah. Venice. That's Venice Beach right there. 
the, the, the when I saw the trailer, I was like, "There's zombies? What?" And it was a it was a parody, basically trailer. It was funny. And like you see the fucking guy already turning into a zombie. He just jogs and he just fucking turns into a zombie. I found that that funny. But when I saw Dead Island 2, I was like, "Wait, Riptide wasn't a sequel?" No, it wasn't. It, it was it, just it, a no. Hit. Still, there's no fucking sequels in this shit. Why there's a, why there's a number two is if it's not a sequel. And don't they have like another one for iOS? No, wait, it's wait. it's uh, it's uh, it's fucking. What was the name of that game? Fuck, it's for. Dead Trigger? No, 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 no. You're comparing a, a good. A, you're, 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 you're comparing a good mobile game to a shitty ass game. Like that's that's sad. When a fucking mobile game is better than a a triple A game. It's, uh, I don't know. When I saw, I'll be honest. When I saw Dead Island, I saw the gameplay. I saw the trailers. And when I looked at it, I was like, wow, a fucking open world island with zombies. That's that's what I wanted. Fucking Resident Evil, you should take notes of this. And when I got into that, when I played the game, I bought it. I was like, what am, why am I hurting myself with this crappy-ass game? Well, I already t told you my experience. Yeah, well, okay, okay. Uh, I mean, this is the only exception I'm going to give. What well, the one good point about Dead Island? The one good point about Dead Island. Well, many uh, three. I'm I'm gonna give three. One, open world, fantastic. Two. Uh, let's put that one. Uh, open world with zombies. Two. <laughs> one and a half. Uh, yeah, one and a half. Yeah. Number two. Uh, it's. I like the questing. I like the questing, but if you don't have good stuff in the quest, not not something yeah. that is re good, you don't give me fucking good rewards with the fucking quest. Nope. And, oh, and, okay, just to put it sure, it had a good concept. It had a good idea. They did it correctly. Man, me, it will be a game of the year. But it was bad. But it was bad executed. Yeah, exactly. And it wasn't completed. Like I played Riptide. Oh god! First I remember when you told. Well, I remember first when you told. First five minutes in the fucking game, I get glitched in a room <laughs> that I can't get out of. I need to restart my PlayStation and fucking play it again. <laughs> when you need to reset your fucking PlayStation, <laughs> to play a fucking game. That hurts. This is not fucking Nintendo SNES bullshit. Oh, you need to reset <laughs> the game. No, this is a fucking. This is next generation, exactly. motherfucker. No, no, it's not. Well, yes, of course, next generation. This is current gen. Like, oh yeah, no, it's not. Fuck? It's not still a next. It's Silver. not still a year, so it's still current gen. Like, literally, if a game you need to reset. The but if you look at it, it but if you look at it this way, Carlos. Work. But if you look at it this way, Carlos, it's basically it a is. next gen console. It's a. Ne it's a fucking. Uh, basically. Now it's an outdated version, but it, yeah, it was. Okay. It, but by that time, it was still stop top in the line, fucking state of the yeah, art so technology. Exactly. But so if you, if there's a game that you need to reset your fucking console, <laughs> I love how we fucking. It's put not. You get, you get so game. mad. It's hilarious. It's not a good game. Like it's a bad game. You shouldn't buy it. Watch YouTube and for a playthrough. That's what I did. But why will you actually tell people to watch playthrough for a horrible game? Are you you want to kill them? You want to fucking torture? No. Them? But what? no. But oh, okay. But we're we're just we're just Before hurting. And we're just hurting it. Dead Island so badly. It's not horrible than Right to Hell. It's not horrible as well, it's still E.T. In, in those top five. It's it, games it's, it's not no. It's it's still not. I hate the game. It, I, it's, hate the game. It, I don't no. like it. I, I'm just gonna say I don't like it. I I don't hate it, but I don't like it. I didn't think that, that game should be dead. Like, okay, that, that, yeah, it's, it's, yeah, thanks for the pun, Carlos. Dead, dead island, yeah. That was that was very smooth. Again, I know where you live. I'll <laughs> punch you down. Oh, man. I'm pissed. Holy shit. <laughs> what? What? Your, 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 your pressure, your blood pressure is going up, Carlos? It's boiling? I didn't even know that was a thing. They were doing a fucking movie. Yeah, it, 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 they're, they're actually making a movie. But uh, I think it's time, guys. Well, thank you very much for listening to the Rating Pending Podcast. I was your host, Victor the Red. And check uh, for the next episode. And like the video. Like the page Rating Pending. Subscribe.
share the video, talk to your friends about this catastrophe Dead Island movie, or if you have seen the One Night Live of The Last of Us, please tell me what you think, what was the best thing that you saw on the One Night Live. Thank you very much. Uh, again, this was Victor the Red, both for Pedro74 and Modern Mega. Goodbye. Bye. Guys. Bye. <laughs> Bye.